Hello everybody, this is Detecting Daddy from Boston, Massachusetts, and yes, we have another box of pennies, and let's take a look at this good stuff that we have in here. It is circulated, as you can see. There are no enders, I already looked on both sides, didn't find any, but didn't find any wheat enders in the last box either. So hopefully this box is a sister box to the last one in which we found uh, the first Indian head penny in two years. So we'll have to see. And what I'm going to do now is show you the folders and what we need. Okay, as I just showed you these not too long ago, I'm not going to go on too long about this here. We have no changes in this the last video. Hopefully we get one or two in this, this video. That would be great. Let's take a look at uh, folder number two. Folder number two did have the 1944S that we found. Other than that, there's been no changes, not even any upgrades in this. I'm hoping to get some of these ones in the 50s and maybe the later 40s to fill in some holes here. That would be great. Let's take a look at book three. Book 3 is complete, although I do want to try upgrading some of these here that just don't look so good. We'll have to see what happens. I managed to upgrade a couple um, in the last hunt. Let's see if we can get a couple more this one. Let's look at the last folder. Okay, here's the last folder. The only one we need here is the 21D. You haven't found it yet. Hopefully you find it soon. These ones here are pretty much in really good condition. This one here I'm trying to keep the light from reflecting from. Uh, but that's what we got so far. And uh, what we're going to do right now is get on to the hunt and I'll be back with the first find. Okay buddy, we're working on roll number four and look what we got. Let's take a look at that. That is a nice old weedy there. Let's take a look under the scope and see what we got for a date. Okay, there it is right there folks. I've been staring at this for a few minutes. So one right here and it looks like a four right there. I can't make out any other number that, that could possibly be. 1914 Philadelphia wheat scent. Not too shabby. Back with the next. Okay, we're on roll number eight right now. Let's see what we got. Just going through, happen to see the weed ears pop out. Let's see if we can get a date. 1946, Philadelphia. We'll take it. Back with the next. Okay, we're on roll number 11. Let's see what we got. Let's take a look right here. 1958, Denver, and. See if we can get that 1944 right there. All right, we'll take them back with the next. Okay, buddy, we're on roll 15, and what do we got? Witty number four. Let's take a look at it under the scope. And there it is, 1957 Philadelphia. Let's take a look. And it is. See if we can get the date. I cannot. One second. And there it is, 1955 Philadelphia. That is weedy number five. We'll take it back with the next. Okay, buddy, on roll 17 here, and look what we got here. Might even be able to see the date. Date came up, uh, date first, so let's see if we can't get it here for you. Nineteen thirty seven, Philadelphia. Back with the next. Two coins later, same roll, 56 Denver. Okay, everybody, we're on roll 18. What do we get? 1944 Philadelphia. We'll take it. Back with the next. Okay, everybody, we're on roll 23. Let's see what we got. 1957 Philadelphia. We'll take it. Back with the next. Okay, everyone, still on roll 23, and we got another weedy. Let's take a look. Take a look at that, 1935 Philadelphia, our third pre-40s weedy of the box, not even halfway through. We'll take it, back with the next. Okay buddy, we're on roll 28, and we just got our 12th weedy of the box, let's take a look, see if we can get the date. The lighting isn't coming up just right, I'll put it on the scope. And there it is, 1952 Denver, we'll be back with the next. Okay buddy, working on roll 35, and look what we have right here, hopefully you can see it. Don't think so. Let me bring it on the screen. And there you have it. 1940 Philadelphia. We'll take it. Back with the next. Okay, buddy. We're on roll 36. And we got another weedy. And there it is. 1953 Denver. We'll take it. Back with the next. Hello, everybody. We are on roll number 43. And we just got weedy number 15. Let's take a look. Here we go. 1957 Denver. We'll take it. Back with the next. Okay, buddy, roll 45, and we got another weedy. Let's take a look. It's another 1957 Philly. We'll take it. Back with the next. 
Okay, everybody, roll 49, and I think this is Weedy number 17 or 18. Let's take And here it is, a 1955 Philadelphia. That 55 looks slightly doubled. I thought so, too, and I took a close look at it. I don't see it. Oh, well, maybe better luck next time. Be back with the next or the wrap-up. Okay, everybody, this box is hunted. I'm going to go over what we got real quickly here. Uh, down over here, we have a 1914, a 35 and 37, all three Philadelphia pre-40s Wheaties. Then we have a 1940, two 44s, and a 46, all Phillies. Here is a 52 Denver, a 53 Denver, two 55s, a 56 Denver, three 57s, and a 57 Denver, followed by a 58 Denver. Those are all the Wheaties we found. Absolutely enjoyed hunting this box for the Wheaties that we did find. Over here is a stack of Canadians, a 70s, 80s, and a couple 90s. Two 2009s, uh, both type 3, one Philly, one Denver. Then we got a 69 San Francisco and a 71 San Francisco. Down here, a couple more goodies, two 59 Philadelphias that I like to hold on to. And then two counter stamp coins. This one here is in 1987 with the counter stamp of Florida. Next one is in 1986 with Santa Claus on it. I'm assuming when my daughter sees that, she's going to take it. Well, I'm going to get what I can into the books and show you what we have. Be right back. Okay, not much to show for this except for book one was the only one that had anything, which is the 1914 that came in. And actually, the 1937 that we got was an upgrade. The other one that was in here was pretty beat up, so that was good. That's all we got for now. Hopefully, next box will get even more into this folder here. Until next time, happy hunting.